Hello, good morning. Welcome back to my weekend vlog. Today I'm kicking it off a little bit early on a Thursday. Today it's October 27th. Just because I have a few fun things planned for today all the way through this weekend. So I thought I would just piece together all my vlog clips and hopefully create a good weekend vlog video. Um, but today I am starting off by going to go grab some coffee from Blue Bottle, um, which is just connected to my building. So it's really quite easy. And then I'm going to start working and I've been awake for now like an hour or so just kind of scrolling on my phone which is not the best use of time but tonight I'm going to this opening of some art gallery for some kinky art which is kind of cool and then afterwards I have this like cocktail event at some bar in like the meatpacking or Chelsea area I think so I think I'm just going to take you guys along with me for the ride and hopefully you guys enjoy this vlog Secure the goods. I got a hojicha latte today from Blue Bottle, which mm, I love the taste of hojicha. It just has this like nutty, nice aroma, and it's like very smooth to go down. Just so perfect. And I also got myself a croissant, and I think I have a call now. finally done with my first meeting have another meeting that I'm running in about like 10 minutes or so usually my week days look really extremely packed they're usually just back to back to back calls and then I can't actually physically do work until usually late afternoon sometime but today is a little bit different today I have a bit more time to just kind of chill and get things done I have a big block during the middle of the day um, and two other meetings later in the afternoon so that's fine um but yeah so that's how my day is looking i'm really excited for tonight but i want to show you guys my nails i got these done yesterday let me flip the camera around so i can actually show you the chrome effect so this is what they look like they are this like lavender lavendery ish color i had them put on this like darker purple pro tip is the chrome powders usually lighten up the color of the polish and i learned this the hard way last time all right so i just ordered lunch from nish nush um, which is like this like Mediterranean place by me and I'm gonna go pick it up right now uh, It's a little bit sunny, but I just need a walk. Honestly, I'm doing something that's like Super tedious at work right now, and I just need a break. It's about like 1. I have a call at 3 30 So I'm just gonna leisurely eat my lunch and work at the same time go on this walk and yeah Alright, so it is 5 p.m. I'm not really done with work yet, but I need to eat something. So I'm going to be making fried shrimp for dinner. Not a lot of it, but just enough to hold me over. And then I might just like eat some fruit or something like that. But here are all the ingredients that are needed. So I have my egg wash, my flour, my panko, and my defrosting shrimp. And also my very dirty uh, air fryer. These are the fried shrimps here that I've breaded and now I'm going to pop them in the air fryer. We're going to air fry them for 450 for 10 minutes. I think that's good. I don't know. I'm kind of eyeballing this so hopefully that's not too high. Actually, you know what? I'm going to make the temperature maybe like 375. I think that's probably good. And then we're going to start it. All right, this is what they look like. I don't know, they look a little dry. Um, I love fried shrimp usually, but this one does look a little crusty, I'm not gonna lie, but we'll do a taste test. It's not bad. Like, I love the shrimp flavor. It kind of tastes like a shrimp chip. But the thing is though, it's not juicy and oily, like if you were to fry it. Uh. All right, so this is my outfit of the night. Let me turn you guys around and do it this way. So I am wearing this lace black dress from Aritzia. It just has like a lace detailing. And <clears throat> I'm wearing this like long sparkly 
dangle necklace and I'm also wearing these long sparkly earrings. I don't know if it's too much, but because the necklace is so like delicate, I'm hoping that it's not too much. And then as for as for my makeup, I have on this pretty glam look. It's like pretty shiny in the inner corner and kind of like an orangey smoky eye with a more natural shade for my lip. Um, so yeah, that's my overall look. Hello my lovely friends, welcome back to the vlog. Today it is October 28th and I'm starting the vlog off a little bit later than usual. It's already noon time but I'm not really hungry yet. I actually just went to go get coffee at this place locally called Split Eights which I absolutely love. It is so cute inside. It's kind of like a speakeasy vibe but it's a coffee shop in the mornings and then it becomes like a cocktail bar speakeasy style <clears throat> at night. My voice is a little scratchy right now. But um, today's like my catch-up day. I started off the morning by like cleaning a little bit around my apartment, putting some stuff away because I was just so tired when I came back last night that I just left everything everywhere. Um, and so I have to do a few more cleanings because as you can probably see, my apartment is pretty messy. And if it's a small apartment, which mine is, it typically just looks really messy the moment you have like even two things like out of whack. Okay, so I've been doing a really poor job of working today and just trying to catch up on errands as well. I did like a few admin stuff at work and then I haven't like physically done much work otherwise, even though I have so much. So I'm gonna drop off a package um, with my doorman for USPS and then go to Dwayne Reed first and then I'll head to Sephora. So that's the game plan. These are the blue that I compiled. So there's this NYX one, and it's just this part right here, but I like the darker blue, um, but I don't like any of the other colors in this one. And there's this one here from Revlon, which it's just this one blue. I don't think that's actually what I need, so I think that's gonna be a no. And there's this Milani one that has two of them, which I do actually like. I like both of these. I feel like this jewel tone one would be relatively good, I think. Like compared to the NYX colors, I think, like these are matte and I like a little bit more sparkle. So I think this is good. And then I also have these pens here in case I wanted to line my eyes. So there's this one, which is a navy kind of blue. They have this jumbo stick which I think is a little dark. I don't think I need this one, so I'm gonna say no to that one. There's this more like brighter blue, which I kind of like. I kind of like this brighter blue. I feel like it's pretty. So those are good options. And then there's this retractable one that's more, I don't really know what the color of it is. It says deep blue. I think that's not what I'm looking for. I think that's gonna be too close to black. So I don't need these. I think the Milani one and these two pencils are likely the best options I have. I'm excited to try out some of these new products, um, but mostly it's just stuff that I needed. <laughs> so I'm FaceTiming, but I also need to try out these new products that I got from Sephora. This one is the Anastasia Fluffy and Fuller Looking Brow Kit. So we'll see. We'll see how this looks like on me. I've never tried the, the whole like silk brow thing, that look. But this one has like the gel. So technically you're supposed to use this brow freeze, brow styling wax thing first. These are all like small portions of it. But like, I don't want to like wear this out. Like I want to like test it out before I go out. It just looks like kind of like a like a gel. 
There's not that much product in here though, like the small one, but I guess it's good just to like test it out. And then I always want to try their uh, their powder. So this is also like a smaller version of it just to make sure it actually like looks right for me. You know? So, all right, let's test this out. So you're supposed to like dip it first in this like gel thingy. With the spoolie, right? With the spoolie, okay. Like just like, I don't know how you do it. Oh uh, shit, maybe I got like too much product, I don't know. And then you're supposed to brush it through the brows. Let's try it on like one of my brows. Oh, it's very thick. Ew, <laughs> kind of feels kind of weird. Ooh, your hair is not moving. Could you imagine how late I would be if I had to do this every time? I'd probably see you the next day. Yeah, like I would never make it to the dinner reservation. Mm -hmm. Um, I guess I feel very trendy right now, but it's just so sticky. You probably get like all sorts of dust and pollen stuff. <gasps> oh my god, could you imagine? Oh my god, that would be terrifying. All right. That took so much longer than I had expected, but that's my, this is my look now. All right, I am headed to dinner now. I'm meeting my best friend for food. Um, we are going to this place that she selected called Oak Tuscan Truffle something. Um, but yeah, it's supposed to be like a place with a bunch of truffles dishes, I guess. Um, I'm wearing these earrings that I got from Mexico City that was locally made. And my makeup is pretty simple. We're actually having a really low-key chill night. We're going to go watch a movie afterwards. I think we're going to watch Smile in uh, Union Square. This is my fit. It's literally just a turtleneck sweater from Maritzia. These black kind of flared jeans from Mother. And I'm going to wear some booties, just black booties. And this pink jacket and my Dior bag. So, yeah. That's the fit. My pretty lady. All right, I am all bundled up and ready to go to Pilates. I always do this where I make like tea and it's too hot to drink for mm, the longest time. <clears throat> and then when I'm actually ready to drink it, it's like already cold basically. So kind of pointless, um, but I do want to make it to Pilates. I need to make sure that I bring my grippy socks. Did I say I was going to Pilates? I said, I meant I'm going to Pure Bar actually. I'm doing a bar class today. Um, and then I need to come back and clean desperately. Mm. And then my goal for today is to um, go to like a coffee shop or like a brunch spot, get some food, do some work, like editing and stuff, and piecing together some videos. I have my iPad charging. And then I'm going to come back and around maybe three or so, I think is when I'm going to start getting ready for Halloween because... I just have a feeling it might take a while. Like, I need to do a whole Sailor Moon head, and I'm really hoping my hair clips come in in time. It's just a whole process, so we'll see. But I'm gonna drink my tea really quickly, and then I'm gonna leave in the next, like, three minutes. That was really good. I needed that for this morning. I feel like before Halloween weekend really starts, this is probably a really good thing to do. But I'm gonna go home now, grab some stuff, and like quickly do a body shower. I wanted to test something out with my hair because tonight I'm being Sailor Moon for Halloween. And I don't exactly know how I'm going to do my bun yet, but I thought I would give it a shot on camera first as like a test run because I've been trying to test out like my makeup and also like now my hair. I just got this product in. It's from Oribe. It's the Air Style Flexible Finish Cream. My hair is a little bit dirty right now, but I'm definitely going to wash it because it's just a little crunchy. So I literally have like all of the Oribe products in my hair right now. So it has like at least some grit to it. Let's see how we're going to do this. I know that I want like a little bit of my fringe out for Sailor Moon, um, 
but I don't know how. Okay, I kind of look like Britney Spears right now, but I think this is probably a better start. So I had initially posted this to my friends, and they were all like, well, it's 50-50 right now, but people were like, you should do the buns. And downstairs, I'm just waiting for my doorman to sign it in, but I did get the little like red hair clips that Sailor Moon has for her hair. So um, we're gonna go all out and test this out. <laughs> These might be like too big. I'm not really sure. We'll see. I might make them a little bit smaller for the Sailor Moon look. Cause I feel like I look like Miley Cyrus right now. I'm just kind of having like a spa moment right now before I cake my face with Sailor Moon makeup. I thought that I would do a nice little sheet mask and my hair is washed. I feel super clean. This is far from a Sunday though, so um, this is all gonna get messed up by tomorrow, but I just thought that, you know, it's good to like give yourself a massage every now and then and just de-stress and relax a little bit. So I'm just going to do this before I start getting ready. Hello, hello. So this is my Sailor Moon costume. Let me first show you the makeup because it's pretty intense. I'm wearing blue eyeliner and sparkles and just like a nudie lip. And then as for my outfit, let's see if this focuses. This is my fit. It's like a sailor costume with red go-go boots. So this is the overall fit. I am super excited for Alesso. Um, pretty interesting makeup. And also my earrings are a moon with a star. And I also have some star glitter on my face. So I'm ready for Halloween. <laughs> Last night was amazing. Alessa was so much fun, but also just so jam-packed, which was super irritating. Um, but I'm gonna head to brunch now. I'm headed to Clinton Street Baking Company. already has all of their Christmas stuff up. It's so cute. Thank you guys so much for watching my channel and I will see you guys in my next vlog.